Hello, happy Wednesday. It is Workout Wednesday. So, the past couple weeks, you know, we've gotten back into school, so a lot of, take care of a lot of parents and kids in the office. So, a lot of hectic um, family schedules we've been having to shuffle around in the office. So, I thought it would be really good to show a workout that um, kind of goes over if you're in a rush. Um, what can you do? What what workout can you get in really quickly? Just a couple really good movements that anybody can really do. And <coughs> excuse me. Um, and then you can just get on with your day if you don't have time to fully get to the gym or fully do a workout. Um, what else can you do? So. You know, my classic Tabata, that's one that I've talked about a couple times. The Tabata is the four minute workout. Anybody has four minutes in day. So doing that is great. But if you can't, um, if you can't get yourself up for that high intensity um, workout, you just, just want to move your body a little bit. Then we're just going to do three basic um, movements. These are some functional movements. We'll do squats, crunches, and push ups today. Um, and it just, you know, 20 minutes out of your day just to move your body and just put a little bit of um, stress into it, good positive stress into it, um, it's going to be really, really good for you. So you can play around with the movements. It doesn't have to be squats, push-ups, and crunches, but those are just three easy ones that I picked today um, because today happens to be a little bit of a busy day for me, so I've got to get my workout in now, and then I've got to get on with my day. So just kind of something I threw together, no brainer. Anybody can do this at home. We're gonna do three rounds. So we'll do 25 squats. And a squat is feet shoulder width apart, hips. And we're just gonna be squatting down and coming back up. That's a squat, it's a functional movement. Um, but very, very important for your brain and for your body. So we'll do 25 of those and then we'll do 25 crunches because your core is so important, especially if you're anybody with back pain, which of course I see in my office all the time. Um, and then we'll do some push-ups because push-ups are really good. They're very challenging to most people, so it's good to push ourselves with those. So we're gonna do 25 squats, 25 crunches, 10 push-ups, and we'll do three rounds of that. I'm gonna turn the music up and we will get to it. 25 squats, here we go. We are pushing our butt back and squatting up. So I'll show you from the side. That's what it looks like. We'll do 25 and go at your own pace. to parallel. If you can't get to parallel, that's okay. Just go to 45 and come up. That's 20. We've got five more. Good job, you guys. Now we'll do our crunches. To do a bicycle crunch. You can do any kind of crunch that you want. Work it on that core. So I'm doing left, right, that's one. So 25 total. Left, right, that's two. That's five. Don't really get much better than this. Oh, 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 tell me 
Good job. Now push up time. And a push up from your knee is perfectly acceptable. That's what I'm going to do today. Body's a little bit sore. So I'm going to just do nice, easy push ups for my knee. I'm going to do 10. We'll do 10 total. Ten. Good job. So that's one round. Just nice, easy movements to get your body moving if you're having a busy day and you don't have time to get into the gym. I'm gonna do a couple. We'll do a couple more rounds of that. But that's just something that you can easily cycle in and out of. If you need to switch it up. You'll move the squats to the lunges. You'll do a different kind of crunch. Um, you might swap the push outs out for push ups out for something else, anything like that. The idea is just to, so I'm doing my 25 squats. So the idea is just to get that body of yours moving. And if you're heading to golf in a little bit, this is a good warm up for golf. Halfway there. Five more. And time for crunches. Back down to your mat or your carpet. I'm doing a bicycle crunch. Left, right is one for 25. Seven.
15. movements. I hope you guys are having a great week. Next week is Spread Joy Week in the office, which you'll be hearing lots about. I'm going to be posting a lot about it, and our office is going to be posting a lot about it. We're very, very excited. So look forward to that. Same time, same place next week. Hope you guys have a great week.